Welcome to the Everything Podcast Season 2, Episode 47. So in the last episode, I reviewed the Doctor Who 2005 Christmas Special, titled The Christmas Invasion. I also revealed uh, the cast and cover for the next uh, War Doctor Begins box set from Big Finish, titled Enemy Minds. And yes, and I also told you what will be coming up in the next couple of episodes. So in today's episode, there will be a review for Season 2, Episode 1 of Modern Doctor 2, titled New Earth. Season 2, Episode 2, titled To Report, we've got some big finish news, and we've got a new feature at the end of the episode. But yes, uh, we're going to start off by with my review of Season 2, Episode 1 of Modern Doctor 2, titled New Earth. Here it is. So the Doctor and Rose are surrounded by pods. The Doctor uses Sonic to open one of these pods, and a man is inside the pod. The Doctor then opens another pod. Rose asks the Doctor which disease it is, and the Doctor replies, all of them. Rose believes every person is a patient, the Doctor collects her revealing they are in fact lab rats. One of the cat people fiction this episode says it's for the greater cause. The Doctor is furious at the cat people and yells, asking how many. The same cat person explains the reasons behind this. One of the reasons the cat person gives and justifies uh, their actions is how many healthy people are, are living on New Earth and are still alive due to this experiment of, as the Doctor calls them, lab rats. The Doctor saves everyone on New Earth by injecting every cure to every illness by hanging on to a rope. Rose is possessed by Cassandra, who you might remember as uh, Cassandra was previously seen in Season 1, Episode 2, which was uh, the end of the world. Cassandra is in Rose's body, clings on to the Doctor for day life. The Doctor over talks to Cassandra. The Doctor squeezes every cure to the to keep as a beaker. The Doctor invites every infected human to attack him. The Doctor asks Rose, uh, who is possessed by Cassandra, to keep her hands on the lever to spread the cure to all the infected humans. The Doctor's plan works, and one of the uh, humans gives the Doctor a hope. On the doctor calls these people new humans. Yes, so that was my review for season one, episode no, season two, episode one of uh, Modern Doctor Two, titled New Earth. It is now time for my review of season two, episode two of Modern Doctor Who, titled Tooth and Claw. So in this episode, uh, Rose is chained up, meets away from a cage, which is enclosing man. Rose suggests the idea of looking away from the man and pulling the chains. The Doctor turns out to be able to transform into a worm. The Doctor runs down a corridor looking for Rose. Rose and the other prisoners are able to snap the chains and set themselves free. The Doctor calls the world beautiful. Well, with the escapes the cage and throws a section of the cage at the Doctor, who manages to narrowly avoid it. Queen Victoria reveals she has survived six assassination attempts and pulls out the gun. The Doctor runs towards the werewolf again handwriting. Uh, the Doctor asks Queen Victoria for the diamond. Queen Victoria agrees. Doctor and Rose using the diamond uh, activate the light chamber which neutralizes the werewolf and the man inside the werewolf has to be set free. The Doctor accepts this request. So uh, yes, uh, that's it for my, the Doctor Who reviews in this episode. So that was Season 2 Episode 1, titled New Earth in Season 2 Episode 2. Title Tooth Call. We are keeping on the Doctor Who theme uh, just for a moment. And that is with uh, the next cast and cover reveal for the next uh, episode in the Once and Future uh, series that 
big range series, The Big Finish are doing, which celebrates the 60th anniversary. So in this episode, it stars... Uh, I should say that this episode is titled Tybord Memorial, in Memorial, and is written by Lisa McMillan. So, uh, Christopher Eccleston plays the Ninth Doctor, David Warner plays the Alternate Universe Doctor, or the Unbound Doctor, uh, Gina McGee plays the Lumiat, who you may have previously seen in the Missy box set. Uh, Robert Powell plays Tabard in Moral, and Nicola Walker plays Liv Jenkins, who I believe who is a who is a co-lead in the Robot Rage from Big Finish, and is also a companion to the Eighth Doctor. So you can pre-order this release. Uh, it re uh, releases in October. Uh, you can pre-order the CD and the digital download for ten ninety nine, or if you just want the download, you can you can pre-order that for eight ninety nine. There is also a bundle, and the two bundles are uh, once in future. Um, so if you just want the CDs, it's seventy two pounds, and if you want the, the, the just the download, it is sixty pounds. But yeah, it is now time for a new feature, which is titled inspirational quote now in this uh, feature so it's going to be like um, so quiz will be the weekly recap episodes then it will follow with what's coming that week then it will be inspirational quote now uh, for the inspirational quote uh, section I will be re re reading a section of a Doctor Who book which is titled the daily doctor uh, 365 and a quarter Universal Meditations on Life and How to Live It, which is written by Simon Greer and Peter Anger Helders. Now, I could do this on the day that this episode is meant to be released, but um, let's say I like there's some technical difficulties, it wouldn't make it right. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna because it's uh, a page by day. I'm going to read the page for when I'm recording this, which is on Saturday the second of September. So uh, yeah. 2nd of September, the title for today's, when I'm recording this, is called Fake News. So, uh, there's a section from an episode, so uh, the doctor says, The monks must have some kind of a machine that creates and broadcasts the myths of their history, the one that are powered by, carried by, fed by your brainwaves. And that is a uh, section of dialogue from The Lie of the Land by Tony White House uh, from 2017, which is part of series 10. The monks shepherded humanity through our formative years, instrumental in all our advances over culture and technology. The Mona Lisa, the electric light bulb, the moon landing, the defeat of the Daleks, the Cybermen, the weak angels. They've been with us since the very beginning. Two species, so history is happening as we show prior. Don't believe in the lingering contravention of the memory crime tax of 1975, etc. Not. The monks arrived only months ago and controlled humanity by broadcasting a false history to a subjugated population enabled by a psychic link established through Bill Potts, who is uh, the Series 10 companion to the Tarth Doctor, played by uh, Peter Capaldi. Fake news and conspiracy theories propagate when people and organisations are selective or untruthful about important matters. Social media makes it easy to share and boost it, especially when it conveniently seems to support your own beliefs, our own. Uh, beliefs and prejudices. It's good to have an open mind, but not so wide open to that your brain falls out. So yes, that is uh, this week's inspirational quote. And that's actually it for the Everything Podcast Season 2, Episode 47. So in the next episode, I'll be reviewing Series 2, Episode 3 of Modern Doc 2, titled School Reunion, and Series 2, Episode 4, titled The Golden Fireplace. We have got a big finish trailer, and we have, guess what, got another feature. So I will see you then. That is it for the Everything Podcast, Season 2, Episode 47.